Dominican Republican Security Forces. Thursday, September 14, 2023 De Jabon. The Dominican Republic and Haiti waited on a border bridge between the two countries. Santo Domingo. Dominican Republic on Sunday. President of Dominican Republic defended decision to close air. Sea and land traffic with neighboring Haiti in his disputes on construction of a channel targeting a river passing through both countries. President Luis Abinader, in a speech on television, Haiti's Mariburu plane to alleviate drought to use in channel aimed at using water from construction of construction of border closing on Friday. He said, Abinader said, we are confronted with people who cannot be able to conspiracy against the stability there. Governments and the security of our water resources because their special interests and said. He accused Haiti of violating 1929 treaty between two countries and said that river is a key. Resource for Dominican farmers and that construction could harm environment. Including a wetland. The precedent of a unilateral irrigation project which is built in a unilaterally built, can lead to the rise of constructions that will destroy the river, he said. The river was named after a bloody war between French and Spanish colonists. And in 1937 it was place of mass of Haitians by Dominican army. Full border closures came four days after announcement that Abinader's administration stopped giving a visa to Haitians and closed border near Northtown de Jabon. He said that it is important raise awareness in the international community to come Haiti's aid. Arbonator said, there is no Dominican solution to Haiti's problem, he said. We cannot ask for more than we do. Haiti Prime Minister's office spokesman rejected the comment. On Sunday, and on Friday, Abinader convened a statement condemning the decision to close all borders while gathering to find a solution. Haiti also wanted help reduce increase in violence of gang. And United States said that Kenya would submit a UN Security Council decision to authorize proposal. Let a multinational police force.